going on guys so i got jamie with me got joshua down here getting some stuff rigged up um we are about to embark on a hbg 14 adventure um hopefully we're going to get a couple of really good ones this evening we're at a pond we haven't fished in quite a while but y'all seen on the channel before but um we're seeing bass swim all in these shallows right here so we've got texas rigs rigged up we got jigs it's about to get ugly hopefully so here we go Yep, second cast. little guy all right i wasn't videoing but i caught this fish it jumped off while i was trying to get my video started and then i didn't put my video on and then it came back and hit it again and it wanted it because it is crushed all right guys i had to get pliers to get it out that sucker choked it but a little chunky bass number three Woo. Dude, I want to get a school fire up like I did last time I was here. I tell you about that. On oh, a chatterbait out in the middle. Oh, there we go. That's a good one. Yeah. Probably not. Back to back with the rattle trap. I mean, they flatten out crushing this rattle trap, dude. That's a healthy fish. That ain't going to help me, but boy, that fish is beautiful. Thank you, Lord. All right. Hey. No, he's got five. Hey, no joke. Throw it at a diagonal pattern about 30 yards off the bank. Well, not that close. You're going to get moss on that one. <laughs> oh, my gosh, dude. They are flat out murdering this freaking rattle trap. That's a fun way to catch them right there. That thing crushed it and ran. Joshua, got a good one? There we go. Yeah, I did. Another three pounder. Joshua's got the double up over there. Whew. Let's go. Yeah, me and Joshua got the double up, baby. That's a good one. All day, three pounders, baby. First cast right there. It's hard not to cast all through here, dude, because I know they're here. Because last time I was here, I freaking murdered them through here. Giant bass, boom, shaka laka. <laughs> That alarm sounded off because I caught this. Throw a different color on. Or throw a chatterbait on. Look at the tail on him. 
brutal. He been he been assaulted. Look at that, Jamie. He flat out smoked that sucker too. I know I'm pinning them like they ain't coming off. If I get them on this, they're I mean they're smoking it. There ain't no doubt. The is, they're coming to the bank. The is, What's that? Black you know black and blue works in here. Trying to be a good, uh, a good friend and not jump in front of you. Well, let's go. Let's go right now. Oh, there you go. Yeah, awesome. Good one. Good one. Good one. Now, that's a four-pounder. Yeah, that's the biggest one of the day. On the chatterbait. I like it. I like it. It's hot. It's very hot. All right. Well, literally tied his smallest in the tournament, but special. gorgeous, gorgeous three seven. Nice and dark. Still got a little belly. On the uh, black and blue chatterbait. Yeah, I got it. You going out there? Yeah, I got you. I got to put my boots on. Just so it ain't a giant belly flop. There we go. That was right at the bank. There you go, Jamie. Number two. A little dinker. My phone's getting hot and it's not one to record, but there's a number seven for me, I believe. So, there we go. Big, long, skinny fish. Is that going to be a call for Mr. Joshua? Um, it'll be pretty close. I think that might do it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Another three and a half pound one. Close to it. There you go. Very nice. All right, guys, I wasn't videoing, but got a solid little three pounder on the uh, Bite Me Baits jig. Guggen Baits crack and crawl on the back. New setup there. Get her put back in the water here. Oh, yeah. It's going down, y'all. But there you go, another one. Another three pounder on the jig, boy. There we go. Get it, get it. I'm wrecking them right now. That's number 10, I think. Nine or 10. Oh. One, there we go. Another one on the jig. Well, it'll be a good video either way if I don't make a call or something. Joshua made a coal, so that's part of the video. Yeah, I want to go around there, but I don't want to crowd them guys either. There we go. That's a giant. That's wild. I hope I got that on video. That that. Yeah, I know it felt a lot bigger than that the way it took off. Three pounder. Three pounder. Hey, there we go on the jig. Help Joshua, not help me. Hey, they're they're pounding this jig for sure. On the jerk bait. so my harness just blew apart a second ago so now i'm having a video like this but it's all good i'll get one ordered here in a minute and we'll be good as new that thing has lasted me uh a solid three years but there we go right. another two and a half three pounder ready once i once i put this one in i'm gonna show y'all my thumb how much we've been let's get the dirt off of it so y'all can see that that sucker is raw Yep. <laughs> All right, guys. Got another solid one. 214 on a jig off the front of that tree. 
nothing that's helping me, but we're catching solid fish, so it's still fun. All right, guys, another close to two pounder. Uh, those reeds and stuff over there. There we go, y'all. All right, guys, well, it's aggravating that my harness broke, but that's part of it. It's been a good one. I've had it for over three years. The whole time I've been doing backwoods, I've had it. Um, but yeah, so catching some really good quality fish um, on the jig and the rattle trap. So hopefully we'll get into some bigger ones over here. I'm moving around the corner, but we got some other guys that are here fishing for bluegill and catfish. So I'm trying not to crowd them up. So here we go. Nice. Yes, sir. Bass, bass fishing cat, last catfish. Heck yeah, big old catfish. Huh? Big old catfish. Hey, on a curly tail. Yeah. Heck of a freaking catfish right there. Look in the mouth. <laughs> Gee. Nice. Chunky some buck. That's close. That's over five pounds probably. Heck yeah. Good eating. For sure. There we go, guys. Like that's number 11 or 12, something like that. I can't remember, but like I said, it's aggravating. I'm not able to video, but it is what it is. So get this one back in the pond. Got a solid one here. Three, seven won't help, but check this out. It just spit that out while I was hooking it up. That's pretty wild, but Good chunk right there, guys. I'm gonna get it put back in here. Heck yeah. All right, guys. Kinda aggravating that I wasn't able to film the back half of this whole video, but. End on the make. Oh, Gotta get on out of here and go on home, but little guy to end it. But, uh, I just about had a big guy to end it. Yeah. It's been a uh, fairly productive day. They were biting good, that's for sure. So, um, I think I caught, I didn't really film all of them because I didn't have the harness and I kept not remembering to do it. But I caught, I think that was number 14, something like that. So, pretty good. A lot of three pounders, that's for sure. A lot of threes and twos. But, uh, anyways, it was a fun time. Hey, be quiet up there. We're trying to film a video. Anyways. Uh, yeah, that was a good time. HVG 14 after today. We only got uh, three or four days left in the tournament. I'm in the lead currently now. Josh was leading the kids bracket. And Jamie's just a couple ounces out of third. So we're going to be grinding, trying to get them. But uh, anyways, we appreciate you guys watching. And we'll see you all in the next one.